Hi Malka Babs, welcome back again to my channel. This is Jean Cañete and you are here in Jean Cañete Vlogs. So today we'll do unboxing for my new phone, Vivo V20 Pro. So let me tell you a little story why I decided to get this phone out of a lot of phones that are out there in the market. So one of the main reasons why is the front camera. For me, it's very important because I do streaming, live streaming, and I also use my phone for uh, my vlogs. So I, I'm kind of not extravagant as far as um, equipment that I use for vlogging. I don't have those SLRs. And, and besides, I want to use uh, something like a, a um, a cell phone that's powerful uh, at the same time you can still do like texting and 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 calling and, and those those things you know all right so for the v20 pro this is the this is the one that has 5g by the way so when you go to their website um, vivaglobal.ph you will see that their endorser is laney by the way ladies and gentlemen that's really good. Now, um, six good reasons why you should pick a uh, Vivo V20 Pro. Uh, one of which is, of course, my favorite 44 MPI auto focus. All right. So while I'm showing you what's inside the uh, box, I want to tell you like a little bit of story um, and highlights of this phone. So it has dual view video, it has 64 MP night camera, and it's very sleek, uh, it's 7.38 millimeter ultra sleek design, uh, 33 watts flash charge, which is definitely good. I really love that feature that um, I think I have charged this for for like five minutes i don't know it's really quick that I, I i don't remember like how long or how short the charging was and um yeah it's it's full charge the next thing you know it's already full charged and then um i think it took me like two days to to charge again so i'm a heavy cp user so that's why Anyway, uh, the chipset is Qualcomm Snapdragon 765G. Now, uh, I think the main um, highlight really for this phone, aside from the charger, is their camera. So the 44 MPI autofocus dual front camera, um, it has the, the clarity, the intricate uh, details of um the quality of the photos i'll show you later the photos but i think uh for the next videos coming videos it's going to be the vivo v20 pro so for now uh the video that you're seeing right now i'm using my old phone and uh, speaking of the old phone the reason why as well one of the reasons why i picked uh, VO V20 Pro aside from its cheap its mid-range price 25,000 pesos um, the storage um, the storage for this is 128 uh, gigabytes ROM and then 8 gig for the RAM so it's really good right um, I remember my old phone has 64 gig only and then yeah but anyway so that's for for the reasons why I really like decided to get vivo out of many phones out there in the market like it's so it's really hard to pick and let me tell you this is the first time that I will do vivo product because uh, for the past few years a decade <laughs> for a decade i've been using um like samsung phones so i'm really into samsung but uh right now i i feel like i want to try something else something new 
So I decided that, you know, Vivo would be a great partner in life. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah, for the audio, as you can see on the video, it has like an auto audio jack just because this one, this phone, unlike the other phones, they have like a 3.5 millimeter uh, jack, audio jack. This one doesn't. So that's why it has like um, uh, an adapter, sound adapter or um where you can so so the adapter there um you or the jack that's where you connect like the headset and then the tip of the auto audio jack is type c so same spot where you connect your charger so meaning if you're charging it then the only way for you to use the sound or uh, like listen to music is if you go speaker or your you'll do like wireless or bluetooth uh, bluetooth speaker or bluetooth headset so anyway uh, i can i can say that i'm really used to using like wired headsets so i think somehow i'll put that on the low lights uh like the audio jack but uh it that it, it, it doesn't affect so much on the quality of the phone still for its sprites it's still good and look at the back of it it's really nice like it changes color um sometimes it color it's it's color blue and sometimes it's violet there's some touch of yellow as well so it's really really nice now uh for the screen so uh the screen is really good uh it already has like a protector um attached to it so it's gonna protect it already and then um by the way it was my brother who helped me buy this phone and i'm really happy that we got and, and and finally chose this as my phone so i'm really excited to use this uh moving forward so you will see a lot of shots using this vivo now i just told you the front uh camera right just so you know, the rear or the main rear camera, it has a staggering 64 MP megapixels, which reveals vibrant details that remain clear even after vigorous zooming. The supporting rear cameras create wide perspectives, super macro, and black and white film effects. So, I took a shot in there it's really clear compared to the pics i had from from this old phone so i'm really amazed how clear how intricate the details are so it's like an hdr for the the uh for the slrs right so i haven't really tried the video yet but I'm really excited to use this on my coming vlogs. So watch out and please follow me, by the way. Follow me on my social media accounts. And follow me on this um, channel, Jean Canieri Vlogs. Okay, so the Snapdragon. So it's, it's dual mode 5G network, right? octa core qualcomm snap snapdragon 756g and so the advanced optimization um help you enjoy low latency connections in a range of tricky situations including elevators and high speed trains and a 5g thrill ride awaits so that's what they say on their website so um the snap qualcomm the snapdragon qualcomm usually it's 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 really like being used for 
uh, phones that has like gaming um, as their highlight so this phone as well can be used uh, for ultra game mode so I'm not really into gaming online gaming so I won't be able to expound more on that but again I'm really happy how this turned out in uh, just the quality of the front cam that's good enough for me plus uh, the, fa uh, the the 33 watts um, fast charging feature that's really really cool and the 128 uh, storage built in so you can by the way expand that to 500 um, I think it's 526 something sorry for that um i may be wrong on that but uh one thing i can assure you it's still expandable so just for the storage i don't have to worry anymore i don't have to um like delete apps delete uh, videos and photos prior to creating a new one because that's that's what i do on on this phone on this my um on this old phone like I have to remove, uh, delete videos first before I can create one. So I'm a happy kiddo. So I hope that uh, this video somehow helped you decide what will be your next pick. What will be your next phone among those mid mid range phones? This is one of the best as well. I can tell, and I'm really happy. So whatever makes you happy, go for it, guys. Uh, I wish I have that money to buy those expensive ones. But I'm super satisfied with what I have right now. So thank you, Vivo. Thank you so much again, guys, for being with me. Uh, so far right now, I have 1,200 plus subscribers. So if you're going to subscribe to me, thank you very much on that. Those who haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and uh, support, you know, small YouTubers. Click on like and you can also leave your comment down below. If you have your Vivo V20 Pro, you can also tell me some highlights that I wasn't able to really um, uh, expose here. Expose. So thank you so much again for, you know, um, supporting me. You can also visit my social media accounts, all right? Ciao. Uh, no rush, no.